Well, home builder sentiment is cooling off a bit, but still remains near historic highs. This is the industry deals with higher construction costs and a shortage of workers. That said, many builders are optimistic that a solid job market, rising consumer confidence and relatively low mortgage rates will help propel housing demand in the coming months. And even as mortgage rates stay near historically low levels, they are moving a bit higher and prospective home buyers are keenly aware. Diana Olick explains. Mortgage applications rose last week, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense because interest rates also rose. Usually applications fall on higher rates, especially refinances. It makes more sense, though, when you factor in fear. Borrowers may have jumped in, worried that the long run of record low rates is over. So applications to refinance led the charge, rising 4% for the week. Refinances are highly sensitive to even small moves in interest rates, and interest rates rose to their highest level since March of last year. Year. The average contract rate for 30-year fixed jumped from 4.23% to 4.33%. That's pretty big. We haven't seen a move like that in a while. And rates edged higher this week as well. While borrowers may be worried, expert economy watchers are not. It doesn't appear as though rates are going to have a significant runaway on the upside, which I think should be supportive for housing uh, purchases. Mortgage applications to purchase a home, which are less rate sensitive, rose 3% for the week and were 7% higher than the same week one year ago. Home buyers may be trying to get a jump on the spring market given how competitive the market's been. The supply of homes for sale is still very low, but there are generally fewer shoppers out this time of year. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Diana Olick in Washington.